All right, so the unreliable electricity supply in Kenya has over the years seen both small and large-scale dairy farmers lose millions of liters of milk. This has mainly been because majority of milk cooling machines use hydro or thermal electricity. On this week's episode of The Next Frontier, Philip Quintani visits a farmer in Eldoret using the solar milk cooling machine who says solar power is the answer to rural electrification. Take a look. Kenya has many innovations that are designed to make the life of its population much better. Among them is the solar milking cooling system at Willie Kirwa's farm in Kapserate, Wasingishu County. The solar milk cooling system was designed in the United States of America under Kirwa's request after years of losing his milk due to unreliable electricity supply experience in many parts of the country. Garama kweli itakuwa juu mara ya kwanza kwa sababu hii kitu utakaponunua ama kuinstall mpaka ifike hapa itakukaribu karibu 4.5 to 5 million. It is farmers in remote areas who experience terrible losses. It is for these reasons that Willie Kirwa decided to look for a lasting solution to this annual problem. Na nikaonelea kwamba wacha niweze kutafuta wataalamu ambaye wanaelewa mambo ya solar. Na nikapata wataalamu wa, wa ambao wanatoka nje ya Amerika, tukawapata kuongea na hawa, nikawauliza na wakaweza kujua namna wanaweza kufanya na wakaweza kutengeneza hii chila ambaye ni the solar milk cooling system consists of a solar generator that provides power to a conventional block ice machine which provides enough ice that is used to cool the milk for up to three days after milking. Ile masiwa tunachili hapa ni 600 na hii chila hiko na nafasi kubadilisho hii tanki. Maziwa ikiongezeka unalete tanki ya ilifu moja ama ilifu moja miambili ama ilifu mbili. The poor road network coupled with lack of electricity in many rural areas, only 75% of the population is connected to the national grid, all conspires to make dairy farming in parts of rural Kenya pretty difficult. Wakati kabila sije nunua sola nilikuwa napeleka maziwa kila siku. Sasaba, napeleka maziwa subui. The availability of a solar milk cooling system like this one gives dairy farmers a new opportunity to collect their milk for even longer days in those remote areas. Wakulima ambayo wako katika nchi yetu ya Kenya tuweze kuungana pamoja, wakulima kama cooperative wanunue chile ambayo inatumia solar if more of these solar powered milk chilling machines are installed in most parts of the country dairy trucks will not have to make daily rounds and no longer need to transport milk from a village collection center to a separate chilling center saving farmers hundreds of shillings kenya experiences 365 days of sunlight every year and with erratic power supply experience in most parts of the country Farmers like these ones have decided to embrace solar technology like the milk cooling machine that you see behind me that has helped these farmers minimize cost in their farms and improve efficiency. Philip Keitan for the next frontier.